what's up hey i'm back at another crazy one i'm gonna get it cleaned up the edges are all gone grass is overgrown it's a lot taller than it looks but it's laid over right now as far as the property goes well it's been left vacant and you know i um come through and i cut a lot of these types of properties whether they're vacant or somebody living in it somebody in need um but i'll drive around and i'll look for ones that you know they look like they haven't been maintained and oftentimes that tells you that somebody that either owns it or is living there is in some kind of situation that they're unable to take care of this type of property well i'm, I'm just looking to help people and it's really hard to to look at a house and and tell from the house what kind of situation is in there like somebody's disabled or whatever it might be those are the type of people i like helping out you can look at a property and go whoa that is overgrown you know for the backyard well We've got all this stuff in the way here. And then there's actually poison ivy growing on the fence and it's really narrow. Let's go ahead and get to it. All right, now that I have it knocked down and height some, I can actually see some of the stuff that's in here that I need to get rid of. Because the one liability you have is you could have hit a rock and not only could something chip off and hit a car driving by, hit the house, bust up the vinyl siding, a window, anything like that, but it could have damaged the mower. All right, so now what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna drop the height. We still have a lot of stuff just laying over, but I'm hoping when I drop the height, I'll be able to cut some of that out. 
I'm gonna go ahead and take it to about three inches and see how that does. Just want to give you a real quick rundown on what I'm doing before I rake this up. I want to go ahead and get the blower out because so I want to get all the grass that's built up against this tree out and away from it. One, that's going to allow me to see what actually needs weeded it. And two, it's going to allow me to get that material into that pile so that I can rake it up and haul it away. All right, let's get back to this.
Now the cool thing about using the tarping method for debris is that it's easy on and easy off. What I mean by that is all the debris is there. All I got to do when I get to the dump is just drag it out of the trailer, dump it off the tarp, load up the tarp and be on my way. So it really cuts down on time at the dump facility versus messing with bags or anything else. So when I mess with debris, having it on tarps makes it fast.
All right, now before I do the final pass on the lawn, I'm going to blow all of the grass that is on the sidewalks, the driveways, off the tree. Just get it all onto the turf, and I'll mow the lawn, and then a little neighbor dog. What's up, bud? Hey, what's your name, man? Yeah. Sorry. Yeah, that's no problem, man. Are you doing YouTube videos? Yeah. Yeah. Want to be in it? Maybe? No. <laughs> uh, if you want to check it out, the channel is Long Care Juggernaut, and then I've got another one called The Boring Channel. Yeah, I think I've heard of you before. Yeah? Yeah. What? I've, I've seen so many people cutting one, but I'll, I'll check if I have. All right, man. Thank you, brother. Have you too. So I'm going to go ahead and get this all cleaned up, blow it into the turf, mow it one more time. After I'm done, I will blow off the concrete one more final time. That's just kind of how it is when you're doing overgrown stuff, is you have to play repeat a little bit.
right so that's that it looks much better i mean better than what it was going from four to six feet high down to three inches is a pretty crazy amount of grass to cut off so it is browned out that will be the last cut of this property for the year guaranteed i've had some questions on how do you let your clients property grow so high before you cut it without them getting mad this isn't my client i don't know who owns this property i didn't care it was a nuisance to the neighborhood i figured i'd come in get it cleaned up it'll make the neighbors happy i'd love to be able to knock knock out the backyard but it's just not an option on this one so instead we get the front yard and i think it came out looking pretty good big burden off their shoulders so you know that's kind of what i like doing is helping people whether it's a surprise or you know really i don't do this for a pat on the back so it's whatever but if you do want to support the channel to allow me to continue doing this kind of stuff a thumbs up and a subscribe goes a very very long ways and leaving a comment really helps the videos out as well get some after shots thank you for the support i really appreciate it like i said it goes a long ways when you uh, support the channel if you just give us a thumbs up share it out if you love us and uh leave a comment you can give me a thumbs down if you want i don't really care uh either way i appreciate you watching i appreciate the support and uh i'm off to the next one we actually had somebody stop by and talk to me while i was on this one and he's got some leaves that he was wanting done i told him yeah i did this for free that's what i do is i go around cutting it for free property owner does not get a bill i do not charge these people in a lot of the videos that i make and if i am charging somebody i am very clear about it in the video not only about how i'm charging but what i am charging so um, nobody will receive a bill for this will the video do do well and you know i make some income off of it i have no idea that's all up to you guys that is all up to you and the roll of the dice with um well with youtube so who knows i don't know i don't really care i just did it because i enjoy doing it so you know i think that's how uh, success happens in life you do what you love doing it shows people enjoy seeing it and then from there you got something pretty cool but i'm doing what i love again you can support that it's up to you so i'm gonna go down there and i'm gonna do some leaves for that guy he said man i got this problem i got leaves i thought about using my mower but uh, that didn't work so i'm gonna show him how i'll knock it out see that in the next one